establish justice, ensure domestic tranquility, provide for the common defense, promote the general welfare, and secure the blessings of liberty to ourselves and our posterity, do ordain and establish this Constitution for the United States of America. Such is the preamble of this Constitution for the United States of America. Notice I say this Constitution for the United States of America, not the Constitution of the United States of America. The Founding Fathers were very careful about details. This means this document. For is a word that indicates past tense, present tense, and future tense. It was for us in the past, it's for us in the present, and it's for us in the future. It's for posterity. It's for our children and our children's children's children. Now, in addition, the last paragraph, Article 7, says the ratification of the conventions of nine states shall be sufficient for the establishment of this Constitution between the states so ratifying the same, done in convention by the unanimous consent of the states present the 17th day of September in the year of our Lord 1787 and of the independence of the United States of America, the 12th, in witness whereof we have heretofore subscribed our names, George Washington, President and Deputy from Virginia. So this is this Constitution. This Constitution is one of the described as the miracle in Philadelphia. It's the greatest document of statesmanship in the history of mankind. This document has been copied by 175 of over 200 nations in the world. That is impact that covers continents and centuries. It transcends space and time. And yet how many of us have read this document in the past day, in the past week, in the past month, or in the past year? This document is the foundation stone upon which our entire United States Republic is based. And we have a republic, not a democracy. Democracy comes the words Greek and demos krasi. Krasi means rule, demos means people, the rabble, the rabble rule. Republic comes from res publica. Rex means king, res is object of the king, object of the king is the rule of law. Publica is the organized group of people. So you can have rabble rule with democracy, or you can have republic, rule of law for the benefit of the people. So we have a republic in America, not a democracy. So we may fight for liberty, but we never fight for democracy. Such the Founding Fathers feared a democracy, and John Adams, my Vice President, said that a democracy is like a mobocracy. So please, never refer to the United States of America as a democracy. Refer to it as a constitutional republic. Thank you, God bless you, and may America bless God. Thank you. <laughs>